And now taking a look outside, we're starting to see the beginning of what will be a very beautiful sunset tonight. Uh, sunsets are always better during the winter time, mainly because ice crystals in the atmosphere help reflect that light and carry it through into some very beautiful colors. So uh, there's a little fun tidbit for you today. Satellite and radar showing us that that high pressure is keeping much of the upper Midwest dry and sunny. That's been our fate for the majority of today, but we are going to start to see some of that cloud cover uh, really start to break apart that we've been seeing later this or earlier this afternoon. Excuse me. That's been sticking into many of our central portions of the viewing area. It's going to lift off to the east and then ultimately leave us with clearer skies as we head into tonight. But a lot of that sunshine in many of our communities have given us an insane amount of warmth. Most of us reaching the upper 40s, lower 50s today. Uh, upper 40s were seen yesterday and the same deal goes for today. We're only going to get warmer as we head into tomorrow. So enjoy these warm temperatures because we're actually going to see a little bit more from where they came from. When it comes to our winds, most of which are pushing out of the south southwest at about 5 to 15 miles an hour. Some individual gusts have popped all the way into the 20s. So again, another very uh, breezy afternoon that we have seen today and we will see those stronger winds factor into tomorrow as well. Future track showing us that overnight a lot of that cloud cover will shift off to the north and the east, ultimately bringing us some clearer skies among many of our communities as we head into the overnight. Tomorrow, it does look like we'll see a little bit of cloud cover start to dense up, partly to mostly cloudy skies, but again, dry skies are anticipated for the entirety of the day. The difference is we'll start to make our way into Saturday, and as we do, chances for rain showers will start to sneak in from many of our southern communities. Uh, pretty much later on Saturday evening. They're going to push through on Saturday, ultimately bringing um, additional rain showers from Saturday into Sunday. Low temperatures tonight are going to be much colder inland, especially for our southern counties that drop all the way to the upper 20s. Of course, Lakeshore community is a little bit warmer, hitting the 40s for lows in Muskegon. Tomorrow, high temperatures, they blast all the way up into the 50s, much warmer than what we tend to see on average. Most of the time, we're reaching about 37 degrees. So significant warmth and a little bit of sunshine expected for tomorrow and then the cloud cover starts to move in. Chances for rain begin to move in as well. Temperatures drop back down into the 40s. We've got a cold blast of air pushing in for Monday and Tuesday of next week where we could see a couple snowflakes on Monday, but the sunshine returns for Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday as temperatures start to rise a little bit closer to what we should see this time of year on average, which are those upper 30s and lower 40s.